Hi everyone, this is Richard. In this video, let's talk about link versus link function. We mentioned in previous videos about link versus link function, and we said basically that if you use link function, all you can do is make a response, right? You could do some other stuff, like, and I made this out just to show you that you could do kind of stupid stuff, okay? Here, the route goes to slash example, and here's a request, and I'm gonna say, string r equals request dot receive date dot to string, right? So the request that be, is being sent, it has some data on it because I'm not actually using the client. I don't really have a body or headers or anything like that. So I'm just gonna leave it alone and just say for the sake of being simple, we'll go over that in the future using the client. Request dot receive date to string. And then I'm gonna say string s equals r is the result, okay? So you can do some stuff within the body of this link function, but that's about it. You're not really gonna call methods or anything like that inside of here. That would make the code really too hard to look at. By the way, this is what it looks like, okay? But, so if you wanna do anything else other than simply make a response right then and there, you can use the link, okay? So the link is the same thing. Route, this is the location of this particular route, link. Now notice, anonymous function right here, right? and it returns a controller, so it'll be right inside of here, and you can return any type of class. But notice there is no request, and this bothered me for a little while. I'm just gonna make a simple class right here. Again, we'll go over the class in the future. I know I keep saying that, but let's build upon one one time at a, one step at a time. Class simple controller, operation.get, and right here, notice request. See, it, it automatically, the request automatically gets sent into this, which it took me a while to figure that out. It automatically gets sent into the class right inside of here. And so you could say request.path.segments.toString. Remember, so the request has some information. Where is the path and where what segments and where is it? So we would say one place right there. And so the paths.segments.toString would be example and one place right here, okay? So that's the difference. If you wanna use link, you do wanna use link if you wanna use some other class or method. If you, you just wanna return a response, link function. And remember, you're not missing anything because there is no request there. Don't worry, it gets sent down into that next step for you. All right. Thanks.